Hello folks, my name is Ed. This video is all about how to play Xbox 360 games with Steam OS. I would like to say a big thanks to the channel subscriber DROM330. He confirmed that he already made some Xbox 360 games run perfectly on Steam OS. So I decided to make a tutorial video for this. This method is not perfect, but this is the best we can get on Steam OS for Xbox 360 emulator right now. There is no native Linux version of the Xbox 360 Xenia emulator. If we go to the Emuldeck emulator's installation page, the Xenia emulator is totally missing here. The only place that we can see the Xenia emulator inside the Emuldeck is from the emulation guides. But if we try to install it from here, it will see there was an issue trying to install the Xenia. But this does not indicate the Xenia will not work on the Steam OS. Fortunately, we can use the Windows version of Xenia with Proton Experimental version through the Steam client. Of course, the Windows version of Xenia on Steam OS will result in a little bit unstable performance. However, until the native Linux version is released, we can use this method to run the Xbox 360 emulator on Steam OS. Now let's go through this process in detail. First, make sure you have Emuldeck installed on your Steam Deck. Second, we need to download the Windows version of Xenia Canary onto our Steam Deck. The download link is available under this video description. After the Xenia is downloaded, extract the zip file first. Then copy the Xenia folder into your old preferred location on your Steam Deck. I will copy it onto my SD card under the emulation Tools folder. Just remember the location where you copied it. Then we can open the Xenia folder and we will see there are only two files here right now. We need to select the exe file and press the L2 shoulder button. Then select Add to Steam. This will add Xenia to the Steam software. After this is done, we can close everything here and return to the gaming mode. Once we get into the gaming mode, press the Steam button and go to the library. Under No Steam, we will see the Xbox 316 Xenia show up here. Just press button A to open this. From this page, go to the right side setting button and press A, then select Properties. Under Properties, select Compatibility. Then check the box, force the use of a specific Steam Play compatibility to and make sure you select Proton Experimental. Then we can press B to go back and select the play button and press A to run the Xenia emulator here. After you see the black screen and wait for 10 seconds. Then press the menu button. You will get this error message. But don't worry, this means everything is good. Now we need to boot back to the desktop mode. After getting to the desktop mode, just go to the Xenia emulate folder. And we will see there are more files showing up now. It only had two files here before. Double click and open the Xenia canary configure.toml file. This is the file we need to edit. After it is opened, just go to line 209 and change the GPU equal to Vulkan. Then we can close this file and make sure you click save before closing it. The next thing we need to do is adding some Xbox 360 game ROMs and make sure the games are copied under the emulation ROMs Xbox 360 folder. So I will have 3 Xbox 360 games in total on my deck. After the copying process is finished, we need to run the email deck. Click Tools and Stuff, then click Steam Room Manager. Click Yes for the pop-up window. Under Parsers, make sure enable the Microsoft Xbox 316 Xenia Emulator. Then click on the Microsoft Xbox 316 Xenia Emulator. Then on the right side of the screen, we need to find the executable configuration. So next, click the browser button on the executable. Then pick the Xenia Canary Emulator. It should show under the recent, but just double check the file location. 
Then we can click Select File. Next, go to the left bottom and click Save button to save this change. Next, move to the top left corner and click Preview button. Then click Generate App List on the bottom area. Finally, click Save App List. Then we can close Email Deck and boot the Steam Deck back to the gaming mode. After booting into the gaming mode, then press the Steam button and go to Library. Under the No Steam tab, we will see all the Xbox 360 games show up there. Then select any game and press button A. Next, go to Settings on the right side and press button A again. Then select Properties. Under Compatibility, make sure check the box in front of Force the use of specific Steam Play compatibility to. The Proton Experimental should be selected here. We need to repeat this process for every single game. Basically, we need to make sure the Xbox 316 game at Xenia Emulator use the same Proton version here. So after we change the compatibility to Proton Experimental, then we can boot up the game. Here you go folks, we have Red Dead Redemption running on the Steam OS with Xbox 316 emulator. This game can be played between 25 to 30 FPS. Now let's talk about the problems that I am facing with the Xbox 316 emulator on Steam OS. Those problems might just be for the specific games that I am talking about here. So the first game, Red Dead Redemption, I found that all the trees and grass are in square shape in this game. But if you don't care, or even if you want to remove trees and grass with the cheat feature in the emulator, then this is not going to be a deal breaker for you. The next game, Halo 3, is running perfectly with good FPS. But when I try to shoot, there is no gunfire effect or ammo effect. Gears of War 2, after this game booted up, I got a black screen but the audio is working, and I can see the gunfire, but nothing else. Fable 2 has a mirror ground effect, the ground just looks like a mirror. Dead or alive, this game cannot even boot up at all, all I got is a black screen. But I am pretty sure some Xbox 360 games will run on Steam OS without any problems. If you have tested any game with Steam OS, please share your experience in the comment below. If you want to know the Xbox 316 emulator performance with Windows on Steam Deck, please check out this video on my channel. Hello there, young Rose. You look hungry. Have you reconsidered my offer? <laughs>